some shit like that. And I never asked this nigga for a 10 cent. I never asked this nigga for, for I never even said, yo, me, come on, do this verse for me. Do this hook for me. Nothing. I never said no malice shit behind his back. I mean, in jail, I'm riding for this nigga. Like, cause niggas start telling me little shit in jail. I guess cause him and Neef was going through it. I'm on this nigga's side over Neef. And this was before me and Neef ain't had any problems. Like, that's my young boy. So the nigga said I was hating. I'm like, damn, man. When the situation had occurred, it's because he asked me to do something for him. Yo, oh, can you put my joint up? All his fans were like, oh, you know, you a hater. You ain't putting up the DC4 album cover. I said, dog, he didn't put up Advertiser 5 or 6. And, he, and I was talking about it on Instagram. He called me. Yeah, old man, just throw that shit up. I'm be young one hand, watch the other. Okay, cool. Will my seven come out? Put my seven up. Mind you, all this shit free to do. <laughs> it's free to do. You know what I mean, even on the strip, even if we, even if we was beefing, even, he's still supposed to say, you know what? I'm gonna put the ship anyway. But he can't. You know why? He don't want the world to hear me. You know what I'm saying? You gotta remember, all the shit that he talking about, he didn't do shit. Which is oh, that's cool. It's entertainment. You know what I mean, but the nigga that now they got a nigga in Philly that really did this shit. You know what I mean, and he can rap better than this nigga. Oh shit. And I would never say me can't rap. The nigga's a beast. You know what I'm saying? The only thing is he don't got no substance. You know what I'm saying? If you look at this most his most song that got the most substance is Tony's story. And I'm telling you, he got that from Jamal's story. He barely changed the name of the fucking title. My shit called Jamal's story on Appetizer 2. You know what I'm saying? Then he come out with the, his shit came out years later. later you know I mean? But you know my shit wasn't mainstream, so they I might come out with two, uh, uh, Jamal Story Part Two. They gonna say I stole it from him. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, right? And it's all entertainment, right? And it's a competition. I'd rather be like this. I know where I stand at. I'm on this side, and you on this side. We ain't got to play those games like acting like we fuck with each other. Fuck you, nigga. All right, fuck me. I'm cool with you fucking me. Fuck you. Fuck you, man. And, 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 and that's it. It ain't no big deal. Because you don't got to do shit. I mean, but I'm glad you didn't do it. Because that gave me the open lane to take Philadelphia over and put niggas on and put niggas in position where well, he had the chance to do it. And ain't do shit. He dick roll everybody else but Philadelphia. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't knocking these other niggas. Like, I ain't got nothing against the boy Chino that ride bikes. I don't know him. He's like a good dude. You know what I mean? But I'm just saying. It was a nigga that Philadelphia that rode bikes better than him. That he's supposed to have with him that died. I mean, not saying he could have prevented him from dying because that's God's will, but you could have gave him the chance that made something his mama somebody proud before he went or died. You know what I'm saying? And he, so I'm looking at this nigga like, damn, now you act like you signed Garcy, then you didn't, and give him no money. You know what I'm saying? That nigga supposed to came here, say, AR Ab, come on. I got the platform, huh? Oskino, come on. NH, come on. Free Forge, come on. You know what I'm saying? This nigga's here that you know been grinding in the trenches for years. That nigga said, uh-uh, fuck that. I'm going to go, because he first wrote to me, I, what I call him is a rich groupie. No, let me go dick ride everybody that's already getting money and just be, be seem cool to be with them. Let me be cool.